Hey there, everyone. This is Matt for Creative. You can find us on Facebook, Twitter, Beam, and Instagram. We also have a GoFundMe page set up. We appreciate all donations because we do rely on our own funds. Thank you very much. Now, today we're here with three things, an iPad Pro, an Apple Pencil for the iPad Pro, and a case made for both. All right, so this is made by Forge. The website is madebyforge.com. If you want to get one, that's M-A-D-E-B-Y-F-O-R-G-E.com. And they have a wallet, but today we're taking a look at the case for the iPad Pro that allows you to hold the Apple Pencil. Now, normally you have your cases for your iPads, but because the iPad Pro has this optional accessory here, sometimes it's a little bit hard to keep a hold of it. Now, there are a few cases out there that do it, now this is one that's made in leather, which is my favorite material for an accessory ever. And it really doesn't in, like make it too much thicker than it would be by just having the iPad. Now before we take a look at it, the pricing goes from $100 to $130 for the normal edition. Now they do have a one-of-a-kind branded one for $150. And the colors they go, black, gray, which they call honey white, camel which is a nice traditional leather and natural white which is a very very light um light leather and again the special edition one of a kind is camel white today we're taking a look at camel white i believe have not opened it yet i'm dying to i've i'd want to see this with my own eyes in front of you this is going to be a good reaction so i thought that the camel would actually do best with space gray but we'll see i'm really excited okay so here we have it i'm gonna tear this off all right so here it is it even says pad and pencil and this feels nice like it, it doesn't have that much weight on it now this is a big big piece of leather as you can see here now i had to put the ultra wide lens on the iphone so i can get everything fitting in here now let's take a look here at the stitching which looks pretty good here's where the i the apple pencil would go and you would be able to stop it from falling out by putting the top here here's where the ipad itself would go in i oh, know there's there's something in here Let's see. Thanks for your support. There is a website again, madebyforge.com. And you can pause this if you really want to here. Here are care recommendations. Cleaning leather, cleaning your product, conditioning instructions, smart keyboard, and pencil. So let's see here. Okay. As with any high-quality natural leather product, you can expect your sleeve to stretch with time. We designed your sleeve to be snug, allowing you to stretch your sleeve for your custom needs. Depending on which orientation you wish to insert your iPad Pro with a smart keyboard, we recommend you do a little pre-stretching to allow enough room for the added accessory. Okay, so that's very cool. So you can actually put the iPad in there just by itself, or you can put it with the Apple keyboard, which is good, so you don't have to take it out. So this protects the entire thing, even the back, if all you want to do is just put a front cover on it. I like that a lot. It gives you options and something to work with. But without further ado, let's put the case inside. This It's really, really nice feeling leather. I just like leather a lot. Okay, so that is, it's pretty snug to begin with right now. So I do believe them when they say pre-stretch it before you put it with its case inside there. So this is how the iPad looks in here. You can see it's all the way down to the bottom. And now let's put the pencil inside here. All right, so that's as deep as it'll go. And let's see, can we fit the top inside that little pocket? so it will not get lost because that's what i'm really worried about is losing the apple pencil okay so there we go it fits nicely in there and you can even see right there it says pencil right oh man that looks really really nice so that's really what it is it's the case but it really doesn't add much bulk of course there's more space on the sides but it's not adding too much thickness so that's the thickness here that's a nice piece 
it's really hard to work with wide pieces of leather trying to keep this as clean as possible because this is supposed to be a very simplistic case and I think they've done a really great job the only wording they have here is pad and pencil I believe nothing on here says made by a forge now the thing is I I usually like things as clean as possible with as little logos or whatever on my clothing on whatever I have but I think they honestly could put something that says maybe pad and pencil, maybe even smaller here, made by Forge, because it's always good to have your branding on something, even if it is very small. Maybe put that on the other side, but still it's a very clean looking case. Now let's see how easy it is to remove this for the first time. Pretty easy. You know, there are some remnants on here because this is a brand new case, but nothing in here is scratching the iPad. And let's take a look inside if you want to see. Okay, I just smelled leather. It smells great. I'm a big fan of leather and that scent. That just may be me being weird. But this is a very nice piece. And again, it's a very wide piece of leather. So I'd say check it out. Again, the website's made by Forge. And the prices go from 100, it's 100 for the black, 100 for the honey, 100 for the camel, which this is it, and it's 130 for the natural white. And again, 150 for the one of a kind branded pad and pencil for the iPad Pro. They also have gift cards here if you want to get it, but check it out. I'm very happy that uh, Made by Forge was able to send this so that I could take a look at it. I'm very happy and I'm really, really happy to have another le leather accessory for the iPad Pro. All right, so again, check it out, madebyforge.com. And here we are at Creative Reviews. Find us on Facebook, Twitter, Beam, or Instagram. We have a GoFundMe page set up. We appreciate all donations because we do rely on our own funds. Thank you very much, and I'll see you guys next time.